taste. It's an excellent choice. You want it all for taste? Break this shit up. Yeah. Hi, welcome back to All for Taste. Today we're going to have one from, uh, from Rogue. This is from the, uh, the Rogue Brewing Company. This is called Rhubarb Schmoobarb. Yeah, I love the name. Um, yeah, as soon as I saw it, I had to pick it up. Actually, the wife saw it and she pointed it out to me. But uh, it says Rhubarb Schmoobarb. It's an ale brewed with strawberries and rhubarb. I'm not really a big... Uh, a fruit beer type uh, type of person, but this uh, this hit me, uh, you know, like like I had to have it. So this says, um, b -b -b what's it say here? I think it's 5.9 percent. Looked it up by the way, 5.9 percent by volume and uh, eight IBUs, so it's not going to be too uh, hoppy. But um, <clears throat> oh yeah, there it is, right there. It says, yep, it says right here on the on the back. It says, well, hashtag rhubarb shubarb, uh 5.9 percent by volume, eight IBUs and eight. 0.7 SRM. What is SRM? Hmm. I have to look that up. Um, but it says, uh, it says do, 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 do. somewhere in here I did see too that it says it's got, actually has lactose in it, so maybe it'll be slightly creamy too. I don't know. Let's go ahead and uh, again, let's here's the uh, here's the artwork. Strawberries and rhubarb right on it. Looks cool. Uh, can on can date. <clears throat> it's like 2-1-2019. This is for. What is today? 4:22, so that's a couple months old. Good. Pop it open. By the way, it's a uh, pint can. It's not just a 12 ounce. It's a 16 ounce can. Very, very cool. Let's go ahead and uh, pop it open right here, which I just did. Um, and let's go ahead and pour it in there. See what kind of head we get on this thing. All right. I was expecting it to be a little uh, pink or uh, you know a little reddish. But it's not at all. It's really um, yeah, it looks just, I don't know, just very light caramel color, maybe like a dark amber, kind of a dark uh, tan. Not eh, too dark, but a, a tan head on it. <clears throat> Pretty good, uh, good finger on it at least. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, take a big whiff. My dog is digging up something over there. Oh, what's she digging? What's she digging? She goes after lizards. You got those little bitty lizards about like this. She she goes after that. But uh, anyway, let's go ahead and smell it. You know, again, I was expecting some type of, well, I was expecting strawberry smell at least, or some type of fruity smell. I do not sweet uh, smell at all. It does smell like it's a little sweet. It smells almost like yingling. I mean, just a, you know, just a regular ale with, uh, you know, some maybe slight caramel smell. Yeah, I do not smell any kind of fruit at all. Let's go ahead and taste it. Now, I got kind of what I was expecting taste-wise. Um, I love rhubarb. Rhubarb to me is, I don't know if you know what rhubarb is, it's, it looks almost like celery, but instead of being green, it's like a reddish, dark reddish color, but it's real tart, uh, real, gar real tart taste. As a matter of fact, in this, uh, this strawberry and rhubarb combination always reminds me of my grandmother. My grandmother always made uh, strawberry rhubarb jelly. Um, it's one of my favorite things, really good stuff. But, uh, you know, I love just taking rhubarb right out of the, out of the ground or wherever, I guess, out of the refrigerator where they're and just eat it like celery. Oh man, it's got that nice tart taste to it. Really cool when you're a kid. But uh, so it does have a slight tart taste to it. I do get that. It's almost like a sour. Um, you know, it, it, it may, trying to get that fruit taste. There's no, I, I don't get any strawberry taste at all. And I really assumed. It would be now. I'm sitting around for two months. I mean, this can't be too old. I mean, it's, this is April, and it was uh, canned in February. I mean, it's two months old, but it—I don't know. It shouldn't have. Uh, oh, that, that taste shouldn't have went away. But uh, I mean, it's not bad. Like I said, though, almost like the smell. It's almost like Yingling to me. Which Yinglings are? I got no problem with Yingling, um, but a little slight tart taste to it. If that, if that makes sense. Um, I mean, it's not bad stuff. But it's not what I expected. I expected a nice, uh, maybe a fruity, with slight uh, tart taste to it. Yeah, kind of disappointing. Like I said, I do get the tart, but no, there's no fruity at all. So, anyway, uh, thanks for watching, guys. This is from Rogue, the rhubarb schmoobarb. Peace.
don't believe these people are getting the idea. Look, folks, it's like this. If you don't work here, and you don't sleep here, you don't sleep with anybody that works here. Well, Dennis, they only have one choice no matter, don't they? Well, that's, that's his choice. Get the hell out!